Hey guys, what's going on? So today I've set the absolutely ridiculous task of making three e-bikes in one afternoon. It's already half twelve in the afternoon. Although it's sunny, the sky behind is completely black. Right there. Really heavy chance of rain. I've actually got no workshop to build these in at the moment, so I'm sort of panicking a bit as it's coming towards the end of the summer. I'm trying to get a workshop build underway. Um, I had the guys in the other day leveling the back of my garden ready to uh, start putting a workshop shed base down. Hopefully I can get something for the winter so I can carry on doing some really cool shit during the winter. But anyway, today's mission is doing three e-bike builds. Although you can only see two, there is a brand new bike that's not even built yet inside this box. So on top of building three bikes, I've actually got to build a mountain bike before I even start. And I think it's about to rain. Get started before we get caked in rain. Right, first things first is gonna take these three controllers and give them all a coat of Hammerite um, direct to metal paint. I like to color code these, it just looks a bit better in my opinion. It's not ideal when it looks like it's about to rain. Hopefully I can get this done quick. Honestly, I've picked the worst day ever. It's actually starting to rain a little bit already. Obviously, I can't do any painting with it raining. However, don't see any reason why I can't just give these a quick coat under my porch. Well, that didn't work as planned, guys. I pulled the controllers out, thought I'd get enough cover off of my porch under my front door. And as you can see by the ground, we've got rained off. I've had to put the bikes away. Um, I'm having to resort to build up an e-bike wheel in my hallway, which is about barely two foot wide. This is why I need a workshop, guys. And this is why I'm busting my balls off trying to do more builds, more videos than usual to help fund the calls. So if you want to put a contribution at all, there's a link to my uh, PayPal donation in the video description. Right, English weather decided to be a massive bell end. I've dragged everything inside, pulled the bikes away, and now. I'm ready for tequilas and Hawaiian shirts. It's decided to be summer again, leaving massive puddles of water everywhere. But the wheel's built up, ready to go on the Vetus. The other two wheels are built up over there, so now I'm gonna start trying to paint the controllers again and hope it doesn't rain this time. If today isn't a sign that I need to get a workshop for the winter, I don't know what is. Hot, cold, raining, sunny, raining, sunny, mostly rainy. Right, it's actually stopped raining again for five minutes. The ground's starting to dry up a little bit and I just managed to get the controllers almost entirely coated in uh, black direct to metal paint. So let them dry up a little bit. I'm going to go and get a little drink from the coffee shop and uh, come back and see if I can actually crack on. Just noticed as I was almost there getting the wheels on every bike the Vetus wheel is now on the Specialized and the Specialized is now on the Vetus so I've put the torque arm and everything on the Specialized I've nearly finished doing the Vetus that's a little bit of a lesson learned when you're trying to build three bikes at once he's putting the wrong wheel on the wrong bike it's kind of impossible to do with the Marin because it's got a tan wall tire on it but yeah I need to walk away from this in five minutes and take a few deep breaths because yeah what is going on guys so it is six o'clock in the evening i'm fucking exhausted um yeah just with the rain today i just bit off way more than i can chew 
it's just a really mega busy week for me. I've got the Carinator, which was I was doing as part of four bikes at the same time, that's built. These three, which I'm trying to smash out today because I've got builders in tomorrow trying to finish up the shed base. Well, I was going to do a separate video for that, but I'm probably just going to, what I'm probably going to do now is just integrate bits of video of the shed base build into the video of these bikes. So I plan to just finish these. I plan to just get the wheels on these bikes today and then just plan to get the wheels on these bikes today so they're just rolling. Um, so I'm running out of time, I'm absolutely exhausted. Um, it's not just the fact that I was trying to build three e-bikes in one day. It's I started a little bit late in the morning. It has been raining absolutely non-stop on and off. Anytime it stopped raining, I brought everything back outside again. Made a start and it started raining again. I had to put the camera away and I just stopped filming. It's been an absolute nightmare. Um, and to be honest, like lately, like the, the YouTube channel was like blown up for the last month or so, and. I just really need to get a workshop so I can actually carry on doing this stuff through the winter and that is pretty much the reason why I'm smashing out so many bikes, so many videos at the moment is trying to, you know, trying to get to that place where I can actually afford to pay for a workshop so I can do this full time. I'm pretty much doing that anyway actually, but I can actually earn full time money for working full time. At the moment I'm working full time doing this, but not necessarily being paid, <laughs> paid for what I'm doing. Anyway, I had to uh, I had to walk away from this because I've just I've got the wheel on the um, I've got the wheel on the Blue Marin, sweet. Put the wheel on the Specialized, got all the uh, brake adjusted, put the torque arm on, great. Went to put the wheel on the Specialized, I think. No, went to put the Specialized wheel on the map, uh, Vetus. Oh god, see, I can't even think straight. Half the work that I did manage to do when it wasn't raining uh, was a complete waste of time and I'm just tired. <laughs> I can't be fucked. This is the reality of it really. It's a bit off way more than I could, I could chew today with the rain. It sucks. Um, I'm knackered. Can't bother to do any more. Um, I've got builders in at half seven in the morning. I need to be videoing that and finishing these bikes at the same time. I'm not sure how that's going to pan out. I'm trying to fly my drone over. <laughs> we'll, we'll see gonna get these bikes rolling on the motor wheels with the correct wheels on flip them over and that's it for tonight so I'm gonna call it that I'll probably just cut to a montage of the bikes as they are <laughs> at this point um, and yeah I'll be back tomorrow evening hopefully these bikes finished and I'll show you a bit of the progress with my start of my garden workshop yeah so all goes to help the calls, any help that you can do, leaving a comment, a like would be greatly appreciated. As my videos are getting out to more people, my subscribers going up, um, I could do bigger and better projects, not just e-bike conversion bills. I've got some <laughs> got some really random stuff coming up that you guys will probably enjoy. So just finding the time to do it, I've got my Mod 1 bike test next week for two days. So much stuff going on that it's really good. Yeah, just a bit overwhelmed with the amount of shit I've got going on as well, to be fair. But it's all good, it's all good. I cannot complain. I'm going to sort these bikes out anyway, and I'll see you guys in the video tomorrow. Take it easy. What is going on, guys? I am absolutely pooped. This was not the best idea I've ever had trying to do three bikes in one day during a rainstorm. But here we are. Wheels all built up. Bikes rolling. Um, Painted up these controllers, which is probably not a bad thing. The paint can go off overnight. And um, yeah, this Vetus was obviously in the box with no wheels, no handlebars. Um, yeah, it's just been a battle of fight in the rain the entire day.
I think that we've all had enough. Keeps you up at night, yeah. Make all the demons quiet, yeah.